The text for our short devotion today, kids, is taken from the Gospel of Mark chapter 1, verses 29 to 34, and it says, As soon as they left the synagogue, they went with James and John to the home of Simon and Andrew. Simon's mother-in-law was in bed with a fever, and they told Jesus about her. So he went to her, took her hand, and helped her up. The fever left her, and she began to wait on them. That evening after sunset, the people brought to Jesus all the sick and demon-possessed. The whole town gathered at the door, and Jesus healed many who had various diseases. He also drove out many demons, but he would not let the demons speak because they knew who he was. Kids, let's sing a song. Oh, I love Jesus. Okay, kids, you follow after me. Oh, I love Jesus. Oh, how I love Jesus. Oh, how I love Jesus. Because he first loved me. Okay, kids, once more. Oh, how I love Jesus. Oh, how I love Jesus. Oh, how I love Jesus. Because he first loved me. Okay, let's sing it. Oh, how I love Jesus. Oh, how I love Jesus. Oh, how I love Jesus. Because he first loved me. Let's sing his pastor. Oh, how I love Jesus. Oh, how I love Jesus. Oh, how I love Jesus. Because he first loved me. Okay, kids. It's not very fun to be sick. Is it? Have you ever been sick? Uh, for me, I think I have been sick uh, last year for about a week. I had colds and cough. But then when you are sick, who takes care of you? Who takes care of, uh, who takes, who takes care of you when you get sick? Your mom? Your dad, your sister, your brother, your grandma, your grandpa, what do they do for you? Yes, they give you food to eat, they take care of you, they tuck you into bed, they give you medicines to drink, yes? Yeah. What about being hurt? Have you ever been hurt? Today's key word is the word heal. And the word heal means to make well or to become healthy. Mark in his gospel tells of a time when Jesus healed Simon's mother-in-law and many others who were sick. He made them well again. When you are sick, maybe it was a cold or a sore throat or maybe whatever was that um, sickness that you had, a headache maybe. Um, perhaps you even had to take medicine for a cough or for a headache, for a cold. Yes? Jesus also healed the hurts of people on the inside. Sometimes people hurt when they are sad. People hurt when they are lonely or they are upset. Jesus can take care of this, the, those hurts too. Today's Bible story teaches us that Jesus prayed for the people who were sick. So when we are sick, what should we do? We should come to Jesus and ask him to pray for us. Ask Jesus to heal us in Jesus.
Jesus loves us, right? Yes, when we are sad, when we are sick, when we are lonely or we are upset and we need healing, let us come to him in prayer and let us remember that Jesus loves us and he will answer our prayers and he will heal and help us. Isn't that wonderful, kids? Yes, Jesus loves us so much. And we love him too, right? Okay, let's sing our song before we pray. Oh, how I love Jesus. Oh, how I love Jesus. Oh, how I love Jesus. Because he first loved me. Let's sing it faster. Oh, how I love Jesus. Oh, how I love Jesus. Oh, how I love Jesus. Because he first loved me. Okay, kids, let's clasp our hands like this and let us pray. Loving and caring God, thank you for taking care of us, of our hurts, of our pain, and of us when we are sick. Please help each and every child, each and every one who, who has hurt in them right now, and help us always remember that you love us and that you are there, always there, always here for us to heal us. Thank you so much. Thank you for loving us, Jesus. In Jesus' precious and strong name we pray. Amen.